Hello, everybody, and welcome to Dread. Now, Dread, I have played this game a very long time ago, and I decided I want to come and revisit this game because I actually missed this game. This game was a really great horror game that I played back then. I loved it. So, yeah, we're going to start a new game. Also, I'm going to let you guys know that I'm out of horror games and stuff. Um, I'm out of, you know, playing horror games and so yeah, uh, from Daybrain, the creator of only the death of us as a collaboration with, we probably present. So yeah, I'm out of horror game ideas, uh, or out of horror games to play, so yeah, that kind of sucks. Dread. I haven't played this game in so long. This game's bringing me some memories. So if anyone could find a horror game that I possibly haven't played or it's like hidden deep in in Roblox where no one hasn't really played it or hasn't seen it, we all see things differently. Um, so if anyone could find that type of game and tell me, but don't give me games that people's already played and I've already played, all right? Uh, most people choose not to see the monsters. Ooh, I don't remember this. Is this added in or we call those who see what's real insane? I don't remember most of this. Is, is it, did they add all of this? What do you choose to see? Pretty has a good introduction, I'm not gonna lie. It's about time I head to work. Okay, so it's about to play the same. Yeah, it plays the same. Alright, uh, press E to access your notes. Mr. Arctim, water resource engineer. Uh, sister, so, for, okay, I'm not even gonna attempt to read that. Hallucination similar to that of other patients. Oh, is that it? Okay. So, um, yeah, if anyone could find any horror games that are just deeped in Roblox, please send me them. Because I'm, I'm in desperate need of horror games. Because I can't find them. I've been working really hard trying to find horror games, and I can't really find any good ones. All right. Uh, Mr. Arctim, I go off uh, to the floors above. Tom's been complaining about a bug problem. I come to check it out. Anyway, since you're the last one in, I've hidden the key cart in a usual spot, and behind the door is a key. Don't want everyone getting in. Anyways, meet me at the upper levels, Phil. Okay. Oh, I remember this area. This game gives me a lot of vibes. I don't know if you guys have played Tread, but it's Tread. Uh, it's a pretty old game. Back in the old days, I, I used to play this game um, a long time ago, but then you know I pretty much quitted. Uh. Up, oh, key card. Oh yeah, I have to drag it. <laughs> I forgot. So, got a key card. We place it in here, and voila, we're in. I don't remember much in this game, but I do know there's a monster down here. He calls himself Prometheus. He wanders around the rural thinking of it as his own. He is the engineer, the master, the creator. Humanity can be controlled. Humanity can be tamed. And when it is, it will be under the rule of the creator. Okay. I know there is a monster down here. I don't know if it's... Uh, I'm trying to remember what the uh, monster was. But I know there is one down here. I don't think it's in this level though. I think it's in the next one where he appears. 
And he is really terrifying. All right, so we got this good looking golden key. I'm gonna take it, open this door upstairs or up in this weird walkway. Alrighty. So I think here is where the monster appears. Oh, someone's in here. Another player. Uh so Tom was complaining about insects, and from what he uh, from what he said, I'm guessing that they were pretty big. Not like the ones you find every day in the sewers. He's pretty scared by them, but I can't seem to find any. Okay. Um, so I'm glad that the creator, um, fixed this game, because this game was broken, so that's pretty amazing. I'm glad that he fixed it. As the water resource manager, I think you need to catch up to us and deal with the, this bug problem. If it's really what Tom says, it's not going to be good for the water, so I just says, I suggest you catch up with us. You'll go to, with Tom to find these bugs, and he's talking about them. Okay. So, it, it really shows that the creator still cares about the game, and it makes me happy that, you know, the creator of this game that's really old, you know, this game's not, you know, new. It's pretty damn old. And I'm glad that, you know, he still cares about the game. You know, it makes me happy. Because I thought this game was going to be kind of left to rot, but no, he actually uh, worked on the game, and uh, he fixed everything, and now you could still play it. So that's pretty cool. Oh, I found a key. Nothing. Oh shit! Yep, there, there it is. It's a big giant ass spider. I'm going to die. No. No. Oh, I can walk by you. Damn it. Yep, I know it. I know there's a going to be a big giant spider. I knew there was going to be something down here. I was trying to remember what it was, but it, it, it was a spider. I forgot all about that spider. I remember seeing him back in the old days. My god, that thing was terrifying back in the old days. Don't tell me that that key that I found is back there and I have to get past that spider. Please tell me the key's back here. Oh god, it's back where the spider is. Spider. Oh, there he is. Hey. I like how you're moving up and down. I think you're... Damn, I remember back in the old days. God, you were very terrifying. But you're not as terrifying as you used to be. But damn, you used to be horrifying to deal with. Bye. I move my very way. Okay. Gotta find the door and get the hell out of this place. <gasps> oh shit, damn it. <laughs> Scared the shit out of me again. I forgot this place is a damn maze. Uh, we dancing in the moonlight. My key is dancing. It's having a good time. Alright. Alright. I don't know if there's anything down in this one. I think there is. I think this one has a monster down here too. Maybe. Probably not. I don't think it does. I think it's just, uh, I think it's the next one when a monster appears. Oh. Tom ran off. He appeared to be chasing something. He was swearing at, at the air as if he were chasing something. Even if I'm losing it a little, little in the deep parts of the sewers, but for the love of all things, 
could please find us. All right, so I missed one page and whatever. I guess you guys can find the missing pages that I miss. Generator powered. So I think I need to find another generator. Oh. Caution, to get the above levels, you must power both pipe room generators, forcing the door to open, may cause serious injury or death. Okay. Good to know. Damn, I remember I used to be scared of this game. Like I said, this game is bringing me back a lot of memories because I used to be scared of this game a long time ago. This game used to be very scary. <laughs> now here I am a lot older in this game. Only thing it does is bring back memories. Now the spider was a little bit freaky. I'm not going to sit there and lie. Oh, I found the five. Um, you got to get up here. There are two cage elevators. One, you get through and meet me there. Tom has been acting really strange. He's felt threatened. It's like something is going to happen to us. Sorry about the inconvenience, but hopefully you'll catch up. Okay. Nope, there's the other generator. Okay, so now we head back. So I think in the four, uh, the next level is where the other monster will appear. Yeah, because this is level four. The next one, I think, is where the monster actually appears. Alright, what do we got here? A German chemist, God, I'm going to be so bad at reading this, Dr. Bayer, the one who had contacted earlier about toxic chemicals in our sewer, gave me a phone call. He said that he had been given an unknown red chemical with a note attached to it saying, Nerder Toad. I hope this chemical won't affect the toxicity if it isn't bad enough already. Up, oh, here's the elevator. Alright, I think this is where the monster appears. Maybe. I could be completely wrong. Might be in the next one, but I'm pretty sure there's one in here. Oh, that that's just great. 85186. That's great. Look how happy he is. At least he was happy when he died. <laughs> At least he was happy when he was died. Yeah, it's it's an old game, guys. Don't judge it. Nope. We need to find the code to the door. Oh, uh, was it eight five one eight six? Ah, man, I have a good memory. I didn't think I was gonna remember that. All right, so now this one is the next level because I know this is the next one right here. Uh, 
this is where the monster actually appears. And he is not, well, he actually is kind of terrifying. Okay, here we are. Now, I know there's a monster in this one. 100% sure. Okay, listen, if you're reading this, then you haven't listened to my warning. There are monsters. Don't believe me? You will be blamed when they they're, they are ripping you apart. I heard laughter. Judging by accent if from an American, please rec consider moving on. If you are so persistent, go on. Okay, well, I do believe you because I've, I've already played this before in the, back in the old days. Yeah, this is what's chasing you. These things. And as you can see, that's broken. So that means there's, there's one down here. Oh shit! And it has some freaky ass music too. Oh my god, that thing's actually chasing me. What? I think there's one though. I can't read my note because that thing is chasing me. But I think there's only one. Oh my god, there's a bunch of notes, but I can't read them. I don't know if that thing has pathfinding. There are monsters, my friend. Unimaginable monsters crafted from my hands. Tools from my masterpiece. The world will see my my magnificent art. I'll see you later, creator. You call them monsters? Are they any better than you? I call them perfect beings. When humanity is overrun by itself, you will know who are the real monsters. Fear is the only beginning. You will soon see the truth about them. You will look at differently and see the mistake we've all made. And you will obey. Okay. Damn it, I need a key. Run, 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 open the door. Game safe. Alright, so I think we're at the last level. Alright, I'm getting through these levels pretty easily. <laughs> I remember playing back in those old days. My god, it would take me forever to get by a level because I was so scared of those things. I hate the spider one. My god, I hate spiders. I hate spiders in general, dude. Alright. That took incredibly long. Holy hell. Alright. So this is the final level, I'm pretty sure. So... Okay, I just went around in circles. Um Dr. Bayer. Oh, it's one of those pencils. Oop. I am watching you. I am controlling you. I'm leading you to where you may ask. I'll tell you. Tell uh, to me. Well. Wow. 
Wow, look at the cops. They look so weird. Okay, so I need three looking pencil things into that. Oh, yeah. They look pencils to me, but I'm, but I'm pretty sure they're not pencils. Okay, grab that. Ah, oh, come on. Grab that. Place that in there. Okay, one more looking pencil, and then when we get into that room. choose to see I don't know I don't know what I choose to see whoa why is just there why is there an invisible wall there okay oh god I forgot how crazy this door is Is that the monster? Okay, I know there's a monster in here. Yep, there it is. Hi. See you over there. Bye. Bye. Creepy motherfuckers. Uh. Oh yeah, do I need like a ladder or something to get up there? I think it's over here. Yep, here it is. Wait, what is it? Tim. <laughs> Tiny Box Tim. <laughs> Tiny Box Tim. Good old Tiny Box Tim. Place him right there. Then the ladder gets up. We run up here. Uh. Oh, there we go. So then we got those. Thanks for playing the demo. Oh, more of this game will be coming soon, but for now, stay tuned for updates. And remember to leave a thumbs up if you enjoy the demo. All right. And there you go. So, you know, I don't, I, I actually don't get uh, what, the blood, those those little things at the end meant like, am I the creator or something? I don't know. No, I don't know what that means. But other than that, there you go. That's Dread. That is the old game that I used to play a long time ago. Um, you know, showing my friends this creepy and scary game, and you know, it used to be pretty scary during its time. But now, you know, it's an old game that you could take a look back and you know say, well. Those are good old memories. 
So yeah, that's pretty much it. That's Dread. If you guys want to play this yourself with friends, because it is multiplayer, you can play with friends on this. Um, it's in the description below. Go ahead and check it out. It's a good game. Um, you know, you could support the creators, you know, that made this game. And, it, and you know, it's still... I'm surprised it still works even after all these years. Well, the creators did update it and fixed it because it was broken at one point, but now they fixed it and stuff. But other than that, thank you guys so much for watching. I'm Mr. Arkham, and I'll be seeing you guys in the next video. Bye-bye.